Hi everyone, today I'm going to make a video to show you how to draw this bowl. You can name it a fruit bowl or whatever you want, but it's just basically to learn, to teach you how to use the sweep command and also some of the spine command, how to do, turn the 2D spine into a 3D spine and then just a cylinder. So it's quite a simple drawing to do, it would take up 5 to 10 minutes and let's get started. So first you want to click the plus sign to get yourself a new drawing and you can start with a circle so we're going to click the center and we're going to make the diameter let's say 50 so to get the diameter of 50 you type in 25 for the radius so i'm just going to move it away from this midpoint or the, the start point of the drawing so next what you want to do is you click on your spine command and you find the spine command there up in your draw tab and let's just draw, draw a random spine the more points you have the better so this is all all that we've drawn so far is just a 2d drawing so to turn this into a 3d we're gonna hold down the shift button and the mouse wheel and just drag to the side so we can get a 3D view. Then we're going to select the spine. And let's say we want to make the height of the bowl. We want to make it 150 pi. Oh, that's quite high. So let's just bring it back down to 100. So we deduct 50 from there. So the second point we're going to move up as well, just 75 this point we're going to move up 50 the second to last point we're just going to move up 25 so then you can rotate around it and just see if you agree with what you have done so i'm quite happy with that so i'm going to move to the next part and just turn the spine into a 3d spine or just a 3d squiggly line so I'm going to draw a circle with the diameter of 1. That's quite thick. So let's just make it a little bit smaller. I'm just going to make it 0 0.5. So all of the dimensions I'm using, I'm typing in on my keyboard and pressing Enter, and that enters the dimension into your AutoCAD window. So next you want to use the sweep command. So the sweep command you can find on the modeling tab. It's the second one there. You can click and go to the sweep command. To use this, you have to select the object you want to sweep. Then you right click to end the selection. Then you select the path you want to sweep. So the spine is going to be the path. And as you can see now, it's created a 3D object. So if you want to view the object that's 3D, you can go into your View tab, click on your Viewports, and select the realistic one. So next, what you want to do is you want to select that and just mirror on that center point. So as you can see, we've created the first two strands of our bowl. So to get this effect of the bowl, we have to use the polar array. So we go onto your modify tab, you click on the polar array, you select your object, we're just going to choose one to start with, and we select the midpoint of the circle. So by default, it's going to give you six objects. So I'm just going to change the items to, let's say, 25. Or let's make it 35. So that's good for now. And then we're going to select the other line that we have already made from the mirror and go to polar array again. Select the midpoint of the circle. So it's also going to start with a default of six items and we're going to change that to 35. So as you can see, it's quite a good looking in this case it's not going to be a bowl it's going to look more like a dustbin but you understand how to use the commands and that's what i want to teach you so 
you're going to close the array command and then you're going to select the cylinder and the cylinder is uh, found on the modeling tab the very first one and you're going to get the center point of the circle again just draw a cylinder to get a base and we're going to make the thickness one millimeter So as you can see, there's a bottom now. And the final step we're gonna do is to draw a circle. So you go on circle, you can get that in the draw command panel. Click on circle, hit three and P enter. That's to get three points for the circle. We're gonna start with there, there, and there. So we're gonna draw another circle just to sweep again, we're going to make the diameter or the radius 0 0.5. So you're going to use the sweep again. So you select the object you want to sweep, right click in the selection and then click the path. So that's how easy it is. So we're finished with this drawing. So if you want to make a bowl, to start with, you don't have to pull the first point of the spine so high and you'll get something that looks like this. So I hope you learned something to new today and I hope this helped you. And see you in the next video. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye.